Another day, another story. Welcome to Scary Stories, where we bring you spine-chilling tales that will leave you with goosebumps. In this episode, we bring you a story of a young priest, Grace, who finds herself on a mission to fight against the forces of darkness and evil. What started as a tragic event turned into a journey of self-discovery and bravery, as Grace faces her fears and battles against ancient entities that threaten the very fabric of reality. But the fight is far from over, and Grace must continue to wage war against the darkness, no matter the cost. So, sit back, turn off the lights, and get ready for a story that will send shivers down your spine. This is the tale of Grace, the warrior priest. Upon learning of the death of his brother priest, Grace is horrified. In her head, memories of happy moments from childhood began to flicker, when they were especially close and ready to protect each other from evil monsters and the forces of darkness. The circumstances of what happened at the place of the tragedy were covered in an official statement by representatives of the church. Grace couldn't shake off the feeling that something was not right about her brother priest's death. She decided to do some digging and investigate the circumstances surrounding his demise. As she delved deeper, Grace stumbled upon some shocking information. Her brother priest had been working on a secret project, which he had hidden from the church authorities. The project involved uncovering an ancient text that was believed to contain the secrets of immortality. Grace shuddered at the thought of what her brother priest had been involved in. The more she investigated, the more Grace realized that her brother priest had fallen victim to a dark force that was beyond his control. The ancient text he had been working on had awakened an evil entity that was now roaming the earth, seeking to destroy all those who stood in its way. Grace knew that she had to act fast to stop the evil entity before it was too late. She called upon her childhood friend, a paranormal investigator, to help her with the investigation. Together, they uncovered the dark secrets of the ancient text and the evil force that it had unleashed. Armed with this knowledge, Grace and her friends set out to destroy the entity and save the world from its destructive power. As they approached the entity's lair, Grace could feel her heart pounding in her chest. She knew that this was the final battle, and everything depended on their success. With a determined look on her face, Grace raised her weapon and charged towards the entity, ready to face whatever was coming her way. She knew that she had to win this battle, no matter what the cost. The fight was fierce and intense, but in the end, Grace emerged victorious. She had saved the world from the evil entity's destructive power, and her brother Priest's death had not been in vain. As she looked up at the sky, Grace knew that her brother Priest was watching over her from above. She felt a sense of peace and closure knowing that she had done everything in her power to honor his memory and protect the world from the forces of darkness. After the battle, Grace and her friend returned to the church, where they revealed the truth about the ancient text and the evil entity that it had unleashed. They urged the church authorities to destroy the text and never again delve into the realm of the supernatural. The church authorities were hesitant at first, but when they realized the gravity of the situation, they agreed to destroy the text and close the chapter on the dark and dangerous project.
Grace felt a sense of relief wash over her as she watched the text burn to ashes. She knew that the world was now safe from the entity's destructive power and that her brother Priest's death had served a greater purpose. As she walked away from the church, Grace knew that she had come a long way since the day she learned of her brother Priest's death. She had faced her fears and had emerged victorious, and she knew that she would never forget the lessons she had learned on this journey. As she looked up at the night sky, Grace whispered a prayer for her brother Priest's soul and for all those who had lost their lives in the fight against the forces of darkness. She knew that their sacrifice had not been in vain and that the world was a safer place because of their bravery and courage. Days turned into weeks, and weeks turned into months. Grace continued her work as a priest, but she couldn't shake off the feeling that something was still not right. She felt a sense of restlessness and unease that she couldn't explain. One night, Grace had a vivid dream. She dreamt that her brother Priest appeared before her, and he had a message for her. He told her that there was still unfinished business that needed her attention. He said that there was another evil entity that had been unleashed and that it was even more dangerous than the one they had faced before. Grace woke up feeling shaken, but she knew that she couldn't ignore the message. She shared her dream with her friend, the paranormal investigator, and together, they set out to investigate. As they delved deeper, they realized that the ancient text that they had destroyed had not been the only one. There were others, hidden away in secret locations, waiting to be discovered by those who sought power and immortality. Grace and her friend knew that they had to act fast to stop the evil entity that had been unleashed. They followed the clues that led them to an abandoned castle, deep in the woods. As they approached the castle, Grace could feel her heart pounding in her chest. She knew that this was going to be a dangerous mission, but she was determined to see it through. Together, Grace and her friend entered the castle, armed with their weapons and their faith. The castle was dark and eerie, and the air was thick with the smell of decay. As they explored the castle, they realized that they were not alone. They could feel the presence of the evil entity lurking in the shadows, waiting to strike. Suddenly, the entity revealed itself, and Grace and her friend found themselves face to face with a creature of pure darkness and evil. The fight was intense, but Grace and her friend were determined to emerge victorious. In the end, they succeeded in destroying the entity but not without a cost. Grace's friend was gravely injured, and they knew that time was running out. As they made their way out of the castle, Grace's friend whispered to her, You have to keep fighting, Grace. You are the only one who can stop them. Grace knew that her friend was right. She had to keep fighting, no matter what the cost. She knew that there were still others out there, waiting to unleash the forces of darkness. As she looked up at the night sky, Grace knew that she had a long journey ahead of her. She had to keep fighting, no matter what the cost, for the sake of all those who had lost their lives in the fight against the forces of darkness. And so, Grace continued her work as a priest, but she also became a warrior, fighting against the forces of darkness and evil, determined to bring light to the darkest corners of the world.
And so, we come to the end of our tale. We have followed the journey of Grace, the warrior priest, as she fought against the forces of darkness and evil. Through her bravery and determination, Grace showed us that even in the face of danger, there is always hope. Her journey was filled with danger and sacrifice, but Grace never gave up. She continued to fight against the darkness, knowing that there was always more work to be done. And though the fight may never truly end, Grace knew that she was not alone. She had her faith, her friends, and the knowledge that she was making a difference in the world. So, as we close the book on this story, we invite you to take a moment and reflect on the lessons that Grace taught us. No matter the circumstances, we can all be warriors in the fight against evil. And with courage, determination, and faith, we can overcome even the darkest of times. Thank you for joining us on Scary Stories. Until next time, keep the lights on and remember, there's always something lurking in the shadows.